Hello, I'm Sandy Sile, a cloud engineer here at the AWS office in Cape Town. Today, I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot the last error replication task out of memory error when using AWS database migration service. Let's get started. When running a database migration task with AWS DMS with low memory on the replication instance, an error will occur that reads last error replication task out of memory error. To find more details about the root cause, you must review the DMS task logs. These logs provide you with more details such as task process for XXS failed because it ran out of memory or any other messages that are related to out of memory situations. You can resolve this task out of memory situations in several ways. Firstly, change the task settings or memory related parameters. Log in to AWS console and go to DMS console. You need to navigate to database migration task. Click your migration task that you want to modify. Go to actions to modify the task settings section for your migration task. Here you can adjust lob settings such as lob max size on the JSON edit. Here you can also adjust validation parameters such as thread count and partition size, parallel thread parameters such as parallel load threads and parallel apply threads, batch apply parameters and other memory settings such as memory limit total. Secondly, if the task fails during the full load phase, then try lowering the number of tables that you load in parallel. If the task is trying to load a large number of tables at the same time, the default is 8 and the maximum is 49. Try reducing the number of tables for the parameter max full load subtask to a smaller value. The right settings for these parameters will depend on your application's requirement and the resources that are available on your server. When you complete your changes, save them. Thirdly, scale up the replication instance class. Before you scale the replication instance class, we must check the Amazon CloudWatch metrics for your DMS replication instance, such as free memory and swap usage. Decreases in free memory or increases or fluctuations in swap usage are signs of memory pressure. In these situations, scale up to a larger replication instance type. To scale the replication instance, you need to modify the replication instance, then change the instance class. Memory optimized instances such as R5 or R6G are good options to use for memory intensive migrations. After changing the instance class, you can choose to apply the modification immediately or during the next maintenance window and save the changes. Fourthly, split the task into multiple tasks. If the single task is trying to migrate a very large amount of data, split the task into two or more separate tasks on different replication instances. First, check the DMS memory usage metric to see how much memory the current task is consuming. Then create a new replication instance and create additional tasks to divide the workload across multiple instances. To create a new replication instance, on the DMS console, navigate to the replication instances. Click Create Replication Instance, then populate the necessary data to ensure that the new replication instance is configured properly. Then click Create Replication Instance. To create the new task, on the DMS console, Go to database migration task, click create task for your task that you wish to create and ensure that each task is properly configured to use the new replication instance. And now you know how to troubleshoot the last error replication task out of memory error when using AWS database migration service. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS. 